All right, hey everyone, I'm bringing you another save hacker for Final Fantasy 13 2. The only thing you guys are going to need to know is that this save hacker has had some issues. Now, this works with all three regions of the game, so this will work with your Japanese, European, and North American releases. However, there have been issues. The first time I used this, my save kept crashing my game. I actually had to rehack my game. So. It's very important that you keep a backup file on hand. This program will automatically back it up for you, and I highly recommend rehashing and re-signing with another program such as Modio or Horizon. Please do that. I'm not responsible for anything that happens with your game or system or you getting banned or anything. You are doing this at your own risk. It is fun to do, but don't blame me or the creators of this program for anything. Thank you. Alright guys, so you're going to need two things. Of course, you're going to need your Final Fantasy save editor, and in addition to that, you're going to need a program to get the save off of your device. I'm using Horizon, you can also use USB XTAF or Monio. Horizon's my favorite. Now, I recommend doing this with a flash drive. You can get it off your hard drive if you have the hard drive transfer kit, but it's easier to do it with a flash drive and it's cheaper. So there's really no reason unless you feel special and you have the um, cable on hand. Okay, so as you can see, I'm about to take the file off my drive. I need to extract the file. You just right-click it, hit extract, and I'm going to go ahead and save it to my desktop. Uh, it takes a little bit of time, um, just a few seconds. It's like 24 megabytes save file. Uh, once you do that, you have to open up your save editor and go ahead and just load it up there. Now as you can see the save editor is pretty basic, it's even easier to use than the original one. You go ahead and load up your save and of course it's going to tell you that it made a backup of your file. The backup of your file is going to go into a folder where the program is called backup and it's very important you keep that in case anything goes wrong. I really really recommend keeping that. Right now all I'm going to do I'm just going to edit a few things on here but you don't want to put in too many things because you could risk hacking up your save too much and crashing your game but uh, just editing gill, magic, and health that's all I did for mine. Once you finish up with all that, um, just go ahead and save the file, re-encrypts it and everything, and it says it rehashed and re-signs it. I'm going to go ahead and save it twice just to be safe. Now, just because it said it rehashed and re-signed, I don't recommend transferring it back there. Use Modio or Horizon to rehash and re-sign it again. This program does not do a good job of doing it on its own. Once it gives you that, all you have to do is inject the file back in. Now, this part coming up, I had a lot of questions about it on my first video. Pretty much everyone asked me right here, do you have to have your profile on here? Do you have to select it? No, because you're using the same profile for that same save. The only reason why you would need this is if you're going to transfer your profile. It doesn't hurt to pick it, but you can go ahead and skip it like I did. I'm going to go ahead and rewrite the file, transfers it over. As you can see, that's it. Um, that's all you need to do. Just go ahead and unplug your device and uh, play your game. You're good to go. Hopefully it works.